G'day guys and welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you're new to our channel, uh, we're a travelling family of five now. We've just had a little boy, little Ollie, he's uh, four weeks old now. And uh, we're travelling Australia full time in our brand new caravan. This thing's uh, about a week old. This midweek episode, I'm going to install these. So I'm going to drill some holes in a couple of week old, very expensive caravan. So, a few of the tools you're going to need for this insole, a drill, some corking stuff, tape measure, pen, rivets, rivet gun, and the max traps mounts. So, what you get in these mounts is the, the actual mounts themselves, which are like 10 mil, very hard, very sturdy plastic. Um, I love them. And you get your pins. And this pack also gives you, it's a, for the flat rack, like your Rhino roof rack, it also gives you a mounting option for that. But we don't need those, we just need the pins and the actual plate itself. So the first step is to get your plates and put the pins in. They just come with a little nut down the bottom, you just screw them in, tighten them up, and um, away you go. Next thing what I'm gonna do is find the center point of the caravan, mark that, and that'll give me a spot to measure from both sides to um, to mark out where I'm going to put these. The Max Tracks actually give you the distance between the mounting pins, and I've checked it. Uh, the distance is 890. So what I'm going to do now is measure half that. So what's that? Quick mass 445. Each side of that center line, and that's where our pins have to line up. So the next thing I'm going to do, I've got my mark. Now come 50 mil down to the top of this from my um, my channel here, and the max tracks have got a few uh, fixing options. I'm just going to do one right in the centre there. Mark that, and then drill that out. I did ring Vacation and um, ask them if there's anything in that back wall that I'm going to hit if I uh, drill into it. And they said, uh, nah, it should be right. So um, I reckon I've got a 50-50 chance of hitting something, um, which is pretty good odds. So I'm gonna go ahead and drill these now. Ooh, first one, we didn't need anything. Yes! So I'm gonna put a bit of, put of this on. This helps with just vibration and all the other stuff and the more glue and uh, all that holding it on the better because the max tracks do weigh a little bit of weight. Give a little jiggle just to suction the sinker flex. Just like that. Our first pin is in. So we're gonna leave that there, that's looking nice and straight. Measure back there, back there. And then we're gonna do the same with our other one and check if the Mac tracks actually fit. That suction with the uh, sealant. Now I'm just gonna quickly check, just put the Mac tracks on there and see if we've got it right. That side. Oh ho ho ho. I think we've done it. So, next step, we're gonna drill some more holes and pop rivets some more uh, rivets in, just to really make it solid. That's pretty well it for the mountain. It's pretty simple. Um, just making sure they fit. And the last little thing, I'm just anal, but I'm gonna run a bead of this. This is um, Solar Flex from Sally's, and um, it is very good out in the weather and the sun and a, and a great glue and sealant. So um, I'm gonna use this and go around all the, um, all the base plates and then over my rivets and everything, just so it will not leak. Um, let that go, put the max tracks on, and uh, we should be finished. So there you have it a uh, installed set of max tracks. Now, pretty easy, or you don't need many tools. Um, word of advice, measure twice, drill once. <laughs> we fluked it, we got it, but um, nah. Max tracks are great, and that is a great mounting system. I have mounted the treads um, before, and I'd much rather uh, 
Max Trax brackets and pins. Uh, lockable, um, you can have two or four and holds it in tight. Yeah, cool bit of gear. I'm getting out of trouble uh, when you're all alone and nobody's there to help. Uh, if you like this sort of video, give it a thumbs up, guys. Uh, leave it in the comments how it uh, went. And uh, yeah, if you want to follow our journey and follow where this van and uh, what the Max Tracks are going to get it out, get us out of, hit the subscribe button and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Cheers, guys. Thanks for watching.